I'm Val Welligan. I've uh, co-owned Novikoski Quality Collision for 20 years with my business partner, Murray Wedower. Novikoski's is an SGI accredited repair facility. We've been repairing vehicles at our shop and another for over 50 years. We have multiple OEM certifications, means we have the proper equipment, tools, and training to repair your vehicle in a safe and efficient manner. Well, our clients get into an accident and that's exactly what they say. What do I do next? We tell them, phone SGI, make your report, then SGI has us uh, do an estimate for them. We take pictures. We may do diagrams on the vehicle to portray the extent of the damages. If we have to disassemble the vehicle to get a clear picture, thorough picture of the damages, we will do so. Pictures are sent to SGI. That is the only way that they can tell the extent of the damage. We do our estimate detailing parts required, labor, repairs, materials. Based on that, SGI will tell us to proceed with ordering parts. When we receive parts, our administrators will schedule a time for the job to come into our shop. Our customer drops off their vehicle for repairs. Our detailers bring it into the wash bay to give it a thorough clean. wash a vehicle so that the uh, repair techs can get a good picture of what they need to do. Um, is the damage confined to a fender? Does it go into a door? Does it go into the next door? Are there scratches underneath all that dirt that you can't see until it's removed? The job is then assigned to an auto body repair technician who then goes over the work order and uh, makes his repair plan. The parts person will bring the parts to them and they begin a disassembly of the vehicle.
There's a wide range of types of repairs that we can do. Uh, they can be a windshield, a minor bumper repair or replacement. It can be extensive. It can be the entire front end of the vehicle with airbags having been deployed where seat belts and interior parts need to be replaced. Um, we do everything. We do suspension, we do air conditioning. Uh, it can be a small job that takes a couple of days. It can be a major job that needs a frame replaced. And depending on the availability of parts, that can go into weeks and even months to do the repairs. A structural repair sometimes requires welding. There's different types of metals and different types of welders that we have in, to order to ensure we've repaired your vehicle properly. Um, if there's hidden damages, we take additional photos to submit to SGI. SGI will approve those or ask for more details. Once that's been approved, we continue on with repairs. Uh, when the tech is done with it, it will go over to the paint shop. The preppers then start prepping on either new parts or working on the panels that have been repaired. Uh, maybe applying body filler, primers, getting it all ready to put into the booth for the painter. Our preppers assist in um, getting the vehicles ready for paint. They make sure that nothing is missed. They mask areas that uh, we don't want any paint on. They sand out scratches. They point things out to the painters to make sure that they don't miss anything. The painter then goes over the work order, decides um, how he's going to proceed. He'll get the paint coat off the vehicle and mix the paint to that paint coat. Each paint coat can have a number of different tinters and based on how much area we're painting, they calculate how much of each tinter is required to paint that vehicle so that it is a factory match. He puts the vehicle in the booth, does a wipe down to get any dust off of it, and uh, hangs any additional parts, like maybe there's a door handle or a mirror that needs to be painted that isn't on the vehicle. Hangs those parts and then goes into the booth and starts doing his thing. Those vehicles then are taken back to the repair techs to perform a reassembly. Um, once they have it reassembled, they do their scans to make sure there's no codes remaining indicating problems. If there's a calibration required, they send those out to a dealer to calibrate things like blind spot sensors, cameras, to ensure your vehicle's back in uh, the condition it was prior to the accident. Once they've ensured that the proper scans and calibrations have been done, it goes back to the detail department for a final wash and detail. Our quality control department goes over the vehicle. They take a look at the repair order, make sure anything extras have been done. Did the client want a little polishing done or his headlights fogged up and he wants them polished? Um, just to ensure everything's looked after the way it was planned to be done.
Okay, once the repairs and detailed and quality control is completed, our admin staff will contact the customer and arrange a time for them to pick up. Uh, once the client comes in to pick up, we'll go over the finished product with them, ensure their satisfaction, have them sign off the repair so that SGI reimburses us for the work that they've done, pay any deductible, and return their rental, and then they're on their way. Uh, running a large independent body shop takes a lot of employees. There's lots of moving parts. There's a lot of things to keep on top of every day, uh, insurance and parts, and does a customer have to return their rental in a certain day? Uh, we have a lot of very qualified, hardworking staff that really care about their job. 